Right, look, I didn't think that this toy looked worth the RRP, so I waited for a price drop, and lo, Hasbro Pulse UK had a 20% discount. Now, there was an additional 5% discount if you had paid for a Pulse membership, so I effectively paid 20 quid for an extra discount of under a fiver. I swear, when they ask me to renew my Pulse membership, I'll be telling them to go and throw shite at the moon. Still, Commander Class Rodimus Prime truly is an excellent package. I still think that even with the discount, he's a little bit overpriced, but he is a lot of fun. Comparisons with Studio Series Hot Rod are inevitable since they came out so close to each other. Both toys share similarities, of course, biggest of all being both are excellent and break from the curse of the last few incarnations of the character being quite lukewarm at best. He comes packaged in his vehicle mode and it's pretty great. It isn't the sleek sports car of Hot Rod, rather a heavier, chunkier, more Cybertronian looking car. So yeah, both toys have a lot in common, but where they collectively differ from me is that they both look like absolute dog shit from behind. There are ports for various blast effects as well as storage for his sword and gun on the car mode itself, which is definitely welcome. You can slide Rodimus into his trailer easily enough, and that's handsome, isn't it? You can add some blast effects to the back exhaust, and some very concerning plumes of smoke for the top stacks. Sorry mate, I wish you'd brought this in a few weeks ago. The trailer itself doesn't have much going on otherwise in this mode. There's a nice flap at the back that has this hydraulic style effect, I suppose. The trailer contains this big gun. Uh, you can place it on top if you're into that kind of thing. I'm definitely not. Overall, it's a surprisingly heavy vehicle mode. I do wish the wheels were a little fancier. They look like buttons on a sturdy winter coat. You could definitely use some gold wheel trims. The transformation to Rodimus Prime really took me by surprise. It's a perfect mix of intricate engineering, more than a handful of fun, satisfying moments. It does feel almost masterpiece level, except I wasn't worried I was going to break something in the process. And here we have a very slick Rodimus Prime, every inch the mature leader that hardly anyone likes. I love the proportions, how sleek he is, and that face sculpt combined with the paint applications, it really does feel special. Not RRP special, but a fantastic toy. I'm constantly finding myself picking him up and messing around with him. He is great fun. You get this sword and gun combo too. The sword is well sculpted and can attach to Rodimus's back. So you take the gun from the storage on his side and you can fold it out to its full, surprisingly large size. Definitely overcompensating. Open up the chest and you've got this cool little matrix. There's also a blast effect you can use to reenact the big transformation from the movie. Like, you know, like this. Look. Yeah? Like this. Pretty good, yeah? So let's look at what else the trailer can do. Slide out this little tray underneath and you've got a storage tray for blast effects and who knows what else. <laughs> Split the sucker down the middle and you've got this big gun from earlier. It's well sculpted, it's a beast of a thing. It folds out and it stands up in the centre becoming a battle platform. It's nice enough to look at. You know, like all trailers though, where are you going to put it? I've got a box full of trailers around here somewhere. Most of the time, it's going to be surplus to requirements. But I suppose I knew that getting into this toy, so it's not really a fair complaint. Oh God, I'm so level-headed. There's, there's a good mix of blast effects to fanny around with too. Minutes of fun. Commander Class Rodimus Prime is an easy toy to recommend. But at that initial price, oof. Everyone's concept of value is different, of course. But I'd say keep an eye out for a discount. I don't think he really justifies the full price. And who are you to say how one justifies their existence? What? I'm, I'm just saying that he's... Who the hell do you think you are? Wait a minute, what, what's, what's going on here? What, what, where, where is all this coming from? You smug son of a bitch! Whoa, 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 where, where, where's, where, where's all this coming from? This isn't like you, what's... What the hell is going on here? 